the elusive parafish has been evading me and Jack throughout the years, throughout the days, throughout the weeks. And we are sick of it. So today we are locking and loading, preparing ourselves. We want to catch the coolest fish we can find. We want those thousand dollar aquarium fish that are right beneath us. We're coming for you today. 66 degrees here in Florida. I am freezing my ass off. I think I have hypothermia on my toes and, and feet. I'm gonna have no fingers or toes by the end of this day. I'm telling you right now, it's freezing here. Everybody make sure to get your Fish Guy mystery box right as Christmas is coming around. Best Christmas gift in the world right now is our Fish Guy mystery box. It's a holiday gift, ladies and gentlemen. We also got new apparel up on the site, brand new shirts, a mystery box. We are living large. We are doing the best things for you guys. Now let's jump into today's video because I'm coming for that parafish. Throw up a picture of the parafish. That's what we want coming for you. There also seems to be an absolute ton of little micro fish today. I'm gonna show you guys a contraption we're using today that's gonna catch hundreds of them, hopefully. But there's literally Sergeant Majors this big. Okay, I'll take the Sergeant Majors this big. That's kind of cool. Our secret contraption, the Bally Hoop Net. Net. This thing has done wonders for me. I absolutely freaking love it. I used it at my dock the other day. If you haven't seen that video, go check it out. Fish Guy Chris. We are dropping it again today. Now that I actually have Fish Guy Jack here, you know, he's a little bit more skilled in the fish game than me, you know, I'm just the drone guy. Maybe we can catch something epic. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna need a serious chummer. I got one right here. Oh my God, guys, there's like four purple tangs oh right God. there. Oh my God, Jack, Jack, there's nine, I'm not even kidding you, there's like 15 purple tangs there. Give me a second. Jack, Holy. 15 purple tangs here. I'm live baiting right now, guys. And it's working. I am live baiting and it is working. This, I'm throwing this guy out there. It's is bringing all the attention Dude, here. those are humongous purple tanks. Jack, you want to get purple tanks Jack, right here. Humongous purple tanks right Jack, here. come on. I'm about to get purple tanks. They don't pay Jack the big bucks for nothing. <laughs> See him? Oh, oh my god, oh, there's yep. two right oh, yeah. there. Two big vibrant. Ones. Very vibrant. Very vibrant. Very vibrant. I know they want shrimp. Oh my god, it's going for oh it. Oh my god, it literally swam to it. Imposter. Very much so an imposter. I think we're going to get the hoop net down there. Guys, we got a serious game plan here. Here's what I'm thinking here. Here's what I'm thinking. The inner fish guy's coming out. We gotta really think deep, think critical. We gotta throw this up current, allow the water and wind to blow it down. And as Chris is, as Chris is chumming, all the fish are gonna go towards the chum. Here, little do they know, fish guy Jack's here, haunting them. Boom, scoop. Okay, I think that's the plan. Guys, about to fully engage this thing. We got chummer right there, shrimp and water, distracting, getting everything off the bottom. Here goes the frisbee. Huge fish right there. Here goes the frisbee. In, engage. Don't mind me. It's like Finding Nemo. Everyone's gonna swim to the bottom. Just watch that movie, great movie. It's different watching it from when you're a kid and when you're a fish guy. When you're a fish guy, you're like, oh, look at that Zoanthic coral. Mm -hmm. And then, look at that freaking uh, butterfly co copper band. So Fish Guy Jack's first initial plan of having Chris basically being the distractor and me coming in like a King Cobra and uh, planning the ah, attack. Fail! Failure. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna load that thing up with all the shrimp we have left, put it on the bottom. It. The thing with that trap is it's clear. I no, it's the T word. Translucent. Translucent. The fish can't see it, so they think they're just eating on top of rocks with a bunch of shrimp. But little do they know, we're right here, ready to pull. The fish so guys the plan. are right there. That's the freaking plan. Now I'm talking. We're gonna let this ferment good 30, 45. He's not gonna expect it. Here comes the fish guy. Ah! We're gonna eat it. Touchdown. It's gonna be over for them. This is the remainder of the shrimp. Down in the freaking midst of the pocket. Never seen before a fish trap right here. I I've never seen a net like a kite. <laughs> right, it's a parasail. That's how. You're gonna freaking fly away. Drop that. It's just gonna sink. Naturally, it's gonna go with the current and find its own spot. Look, come here, come here, come here. Look, look, look down. They're huge. Look how big they are. Can oh my see? god, that's bottom? what I've been seeing. There's like 20,000 of them. You can't really Those see. Those are all ginormous bullets. Do you think we can get them with the, with the glizzy? You might be able to. The okay, flying glizzy has to get re engaged. Flying, flying glizzy. glizzy. Nice. Flying glizzy is engaged. <laughs> Why is it called that? I don't know. Pull see, fast. see if this one over it. Should we pull? Pull fast. Pull. Oh, oh my god, look at this. got them. <laughs> there's so many. Dude, look at them swimming around the glizzy. Why don't you... Dude, there's so many. They're swimming all around it. Oh my dude. god, look at it. Flying glizzy cannot get the moving glizzies. That's the moral of the story. Let's get this thing ferment, all right? Let's go. All right, okay. way down there in the bottom of the nut sack, right there, you have a couple shrimp at the, in the nut sack of the net. You have the glizzy, and then you got the nut sack. Jack! <laughs> so inappropriate. I'm kidding. All right, right down there in the pouch. We'll call it the pouch. Yeah, we'll call it the the giant condom. <laughs> it is a giant condom. It's a <laughs> elephant condom. <laughs> <laughs> All right, right, throw that elephant condom down there. We're throwing the elephant condom in the water. <laughs> we gotta let that thing ferment. Down below, bunch of rocks. What we need, baby. All right, let it sit. Let her sink. I'm gonna tie it to here, okay? Right here. Perfect. Right to this. All right, it's been sitting there for quite some time. I think it's time to pull it. What I think it's say? definitely time to pull it. We got some serious slack in the line. We gotta pull this puppy. All right, let's pull it. Perfect. I'm pulling. I'm pulling. 
It's usually at the bottom of the glizzy. Oh my god, yeah, we're loaded. We got loaded fish. Oh my god. Oh my god, we're actually loaded. Oh my god, Japanese grass. I gotta get a bucket of water. Get a bucket of water, bucket of water, bucket of water. Japanese grass. Brooke. Oh my god. We gotta go here. Oh my god, Brooke. Dude. Oh my god. That's the prettiest aquarium fish we've ever caught in our lives. Write that down in the history Literally books. Rainbow wrasse. Rainbow wrasse. Is that a rainbow wrasse? Oh my god, another rainbow wrasse. Another rainbow wrasse. This is not a drill. This is not a drill. God, they're slippery. Dude. Rainbow wrasse. Another. Chris, Chris, dude, look at this. Right. I think I need to see a doctor. I get winded so quick. Right. What? We caught the freaking Japanese wrasse. Put him in the bucket. Put him in the bucket. Let me get some rainbow. Put him in the Oh my god, I just cracked my glasses. Critter. That's <laughs> $200 rainbow. $300 rainbow. Okay, hang on. I don't want to kill these. Put these both oh my god, we got multiple of them? Multiple, two. Shut the hell up. Those are keepers. How do you put how do you get these things out of this though? Okay, so it's one step below a pair of fish though. It's there one. You go. Dude! Oh my god. god. We got a lot. Sergeant Major. I think we keep the Oh my god, another one. Look at that one. Dude, three! That one is sick. Three so gorgeous. Three rasses. That's a full-blown aquarium. That's right a there. freaking pair of fish. If I've never seen one. How you doing? Dude, dual damsel action. Biggest damsels we've yeah, ever I've probably never seen. seen. I've never seen a mocha damsel before. I've never so, seen one. I'm gonna call those mochas. Mocha damsel. Oh, this one got eaten. Oh my god. Keep He's a strong. He's the strong. We're he deserves this. But can I? Can we keep this one? And let this one go. Yeah, He's, yeah. He survived let, an attack. Okay, let him. Let him survive the attack. Okay. It, it goes parrotfish, Japanese wrasse. We caught three Japanese wrasse. Those are freaking rainbow fish. Oh my and god. grunts. And a bunch of grunts. What do you want to do with these? We'll keep the small one to feed to the lionfish. Cut the small one. Lionfish. Guys, we got three. You know, those used to be seventy dollars. Those are probably two hundred fifty dollars fish each. One thousand percent inflation is a bitch. Everyone buy Bitcoin. Let's get back to the crib. Let's put these in the tank. The sacrificial lamb. We brought a sacrificial lamb. This grunt. May the fish gods bless you, sir. But you need to be food for our awesome lionfish. This is the first order of business every time. Who's gonna get the lionfish <laughs> or the eel, though? That's the question here. He knows. Now he knows. we have he to knows. wait. He knows. He already knows. He already knows. He's already spinning. Come on, dude. Do it. Oh, you missed! Oh, missed. He'll Where get him. Go? He'll get him. He's right here. Here comes the eel. Here comes the eel. Never a good sign when that eel comes out of the back. Oh my God, the, eel. the eel's going right for him. Sneak attack underneath the lionfish. Like a the, eel, the eel's going underneath the lionfish. Oh, oh my God! That is such I just a got that eel. set. <laughs> Holding on camera. He's got it right here. He's got it right here. He just sneak attacked underneath the lionfish and smoked that thing like a gelato. Dude, the lionfish is so upset. All right, we gotta feed the lionfish that damsel. Yeah, give him that yeah. damsel. The mocha damsel, never seen before. It's brown. Usually I thought they were blue. Mega. I got one for you, brother. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. lionfish sees it. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, <laughs> he knows to go to the rocks. He went in the hole. He went in the hole. Okay, the hole of doom. He's in the hole of doom. Oh, we didn't feed this guy. That's okay. The thing I'm worried about is, I think the rats are big enough where they won't get eaten in here. Yeah, they know they won't. Because we have a trigger like this big. So I think the rats are good. We got the coolest freaking fish today. Literally, you took a rainbow and God threw it on the ground and stepped on it. We caught it. And he created a fish. In a hoop net. Yes, sir. Let's see. This is probably the best one, dude. No cap on it. Super colorful. That's great. Hold dude. that, dude. Let me get the light on him. That is the most insane fish. Coolest fish ever. That is insane. That is actually insane. That is crazy. All right, I'm gonna put him in. Put Bro. him in, put him in. Whoa. He's on the ground. Ah! Here he goes. Welcome aboard. Whoa. It goes right to the rock like a tweet. Hopefully he doesn't die. <laughs> All right, let's get, oh, these are the ones that go on the ground. This one's a mega. This one has a cool black spot. We got a black spot on him. Mm -hmm. Still got a colorful head, dude. Yeah, That's very so colorful. Sick. Welcome. Don't go in the sand, buddy. Last one, but not least, I, it's triplets. Let's just be real, they're triplets. They're they all triplets. look the same. Yeah. The rash triplets. The rash triplets, here we go. Three musketeers. He's in. They go right to the rock. Smart fish. Smart fish. That's another wild cop. Big brains on those things. Go check out the Fish Guy Mystery Boxes. Cop one for Christmas, Hanukkah, Yom Kippur. The fish guys are out. We will see you in the next one. Adios.